On this episode of Fife Paranormal, I investigate the George Paris Cemetery in Giles County, Virginia, a cemetery where it is said a local satanic group used to perform many rituals at and where some of the entities they conjured up still remain. Hello everyone, this is Jake from Fife Paranormal and I'm about to head up to the George Paris Cemetery here in Virginia. It's said to be one of the most haunted and active cemeteries in Giles County. And I've also heard some stories that it's the former headquarters of a local satanic group. And it's, I've heard some people say that it's also guarded by an evil entity, so let's find out. The trail leading up to the cemetery is a part of the Appalachian Trail. Some people say there's a very disturbing energy attached to the Appalachian Trail, and I was hoping some of that would rub off on the cemetery. It's a bit of a hike. <sighs> people have been scratched, hit, bruised, and have had dark encounters with entities at this cemetery. After walking for what seems like an hour, we have made it to the George Paris Cemetery. As soon as I entered the cemetery, I knew something was going to happen. Now this cemetery is named for Captain George Paris of the Virginia Militia in the American Revolutionary War, and this, behind me, is his grave. Now yesterday was the anniversary of his death, so this is going to be the very first place I'm going to conduct a spirit box session. I have the spirit box set up in front of the grave of George Paris. I will be scanning at 100 milliseconds on forward sweep. And let's see what happens. As stated earlier, yesterday was the anniversary of his death, so maybe he's still around. All right, hello, is there anyone here with me today? Jake and I'd like to talk to anyone that may be here in the cemetery. I would get no more responses the rest of this session, so I moved to another spot. Something that I always heard about cemeteries to watch out for is if they have really messed up looking trees is and they don't look natural, such as that tree there and then that one there and there's one back there, typically that means there's negative energy around. And this cemetery is said to be full of nothing but negative energy. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to walk through the cemetery with the spirit box and see what I can get. Alright, hello, is there anyone here with me today? Of course, here's the cemetery. Yeah? How many people are in the cemetery with me today? My name's Jake, and I want to talk with anyone who's in the cemetery that would like to talk with me. 
Is anyone the one to talk? Christian. You do? I heard a voice, I don't know what it said. Whoever just spoke, can you please say your name? scene from a horror movie. Do you like me being here trying to talk to you? You want me to leave? Once again, the spirits fell silent. I was a little disappointed. I had heard so much about the paranormal claims of the cemetery, but not really anything was happening. I was wanting to know once and for all whether or not there had been rituals performed, and so I conducted one last session. All right, well, we're going to do one final spirit box session before we call it a day. Now, we have heard some strange things. We've seen some weird stuff. There's a weird smell that came over as I was walking through here on the last part you all saw. So hopefully this final spirit box session, the spirits have warmed up, and they're ready to go. Session can now begin. All right, hello. Is there anyone here in this part of the cemetery with us? There's a figure we've been seeing towards the back of the cemetery up here moving in the brush. Who's that person? Could have been a voice, could have been radio. Mm -hmm. If you can see us or hear us, please say hi as loud and as clear as you possibly can. Right. 
George Paris, Captain George Paris. The cemetery is named after you. Are you here with us? Is anyone else here with us? As I stated before, we're not here to hurt you. We've heard that a lot of people have seen and heard strange things up here, and we just want to talk to whoever's here. Sound like a male voice. If you would like to talk to us, can you please say hello? Do you like that it's fall now and the leaves are changing? There's a voice. It sounded like a male voice said, I don't care. You don't care that the leaves are changing? Do you want us to leave? I just heard an electronic voice. That sounded like, almost like a vocoder. It sounded like metallic. Who's here in the back of the cemetery? And why are you hiding from us? Do you want us to come back there and talk to you? Not really? Why? Are you scared of us? What would happen if we went back there? Well, we're gonna go back there. Is there anyone in this part of the cemetery? Try not to fall in our grave, that would be awful. The one. A male voice, Steve just said the one. Who's the one? One of the reasons we came up here is because I've heard stories that there are evil spirits up here and that they attack people that try to talk to the spirits of the cemetery. Are there evil spirits up here? Did you hear it? Yep. Sound like said yep. If there are evil spirits, can they say hello? Why are there evil spirits here? Problem. Voice just said, what problem? Get out. Did you hear it? Metallic voice, get out. Typically, folks, metallic voices are inhuman spirits. Although sometimes, for strange reasons, human voices do appear as metallic, but typically they aren't. And one of the main reasons we're here, as I stated to the spirits, is I want to know why the cemetery has a reputation for not just being haunted, but for being evil. Is the man that we've been seeing in these weeds back here evil? The heck was that? That's a growl. That was a full, honest to God growl. Who's growling at us? Can you growl again? Who's the man that's in the back of the cemetery that's been watching us?
Can he show himself to us? Can. I can? Sound like a female voice. Could have been radio. Are we getting close to where they used to do summoning rituals? Female voice. I can't tell what it said. Whoever just spoke, thank you. Can you please say that again? I can not tell. Who's here with us right now? I noticed when I started talking about evil entities that you all started getting angry. Why is that? So what happens here at night? Does anything happen here at night? So once and for all, I would like this to be settled. Can you please answer this one question for us? Were there satanic rituals done in this cemetery? Yes, he said yes, male voice. Were they summoning rituals? Were there sacrifices done up here? said yeah. Male voice said yeah. Are we standing near one of those sites? Were the rituals done in the cemetery here where we are or were they done in the woods? I've also heard that there's a guardian spirit, evil demon, whatever they call it, but there's a guardian of this cemetery that runs people off. Is that true? Guardian? Are you the guardian? Is the guardian here with us? All of a sudden, no radio, nothing. It's dead, pun intended. <laughs> Is the Guardian good or bad? Do you want us to leave the cemetery? Die. Did you hear that? It just said freaking die. Who do you want to die? Why do you want someone to die? I'm gonna have to remember, that's at the 10 minute 50 mark. Did you really just say die? That was another voice in response to it. Who wants us to die? Identify yourself. There, I saw something duck behind that chair. The stone chair right there to the right, I saw something duck behind it. Could have been an animal, could have been a bird, but I saw movement. Who did I just see over there?
It's me. Who's me? Can me identify the me self? Well, we're gonna head towards you. Did you hear it said okay? Are you still back there behind that chair? On the, you're on the chair? Okay, let's try this. If you're really on the chair, can you make that stick move? Can you tip it over? You want to move the stick? Okay. All right, go ahead and do it. That didn't sound right. What's your name so that we know what to call you? Are you still sitting in the chair? Get out. Do you hear it? No, boy, say get out. Aside from that, I heard footsteps over here. Is someone else coming to join you? You said you're still sitting in the chair? I'm going to sit with you. Are you still in the chair with me? Whoever is here, I hope I didn't take your spot. But are you still here? What? Are you sitting next to me right now? Are you sitting in the other chair? You can move the stick if you want to sit down next to me. Are the evil spirits still here or did they leave? Alright, we're going to go ahead and leave. Is there anything you want to tell us before we leave the cemetery? Can you say my name? Once again, no radio. Is that Guardian still here? Is he still watching us? He's gone. Did you hear that voice? He said a full thing. He's gone. Where did he go? Since I'm close to his grave, before I go, George Paris, are you here? Can you say goodbye? <coughs> Hello? Captain Paris, is that you? Can anyone else say goodbye? Well, I'm going to go ahead and go. Thank you all. 
who spoke to us and who tried to speak. I appreciate the effort. It's going to be a while before I'm back here again. Is there anything you want to say before I turn this off? Alright, well goodbye. My goal during this investigation was finding out whether or not there really were satanic rituals performed at this cemetery, and I believe I found my answer. But who knows who or what I really make contact with. Maybe on a return trip, I'll get the answer for that question. Thank you all for tuning in to this episode of Fife Paranormal. I hope you all enjoyed it. This was a really, really active investigation. I can't wait to come back here, but once again from Fife Paranormal, I'm Jake. Have a great day, everyone.